fire in where we are living and we have farm in that place your what our oc our oga oga wife okay he put fire in a dustbin where we are living and we have farm in that place so the fire jump into the farm into into the bush and begin to burn everywhere and many people are having farm in that place my own farm is in the center of the bush so what this God of chosen did for me, in fact, I give glory to him. The fire burned all the farm. And my farm, my own that is in the center, he burned around and leave only my own. Fire <laughs> did not enter my farm. Thank you, God of chosen. Clap unto him. Appreciate him. Thank you, Father. So I pray for this God that who, he who have done it for me, may his name alone be praised in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I pray for our Geo heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray for the church heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray for my family heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. You, you mean Jesus. other people's farm were burnt? Yes, sir. But your own farm, God of choosing, preserved it. Yes, sir. And all the farms are together. Yes, sir. All Almost on the same expanse of land. Yes, sir. And the fire burns others' own, and God will choose and preserve your own. Yes, sir. It what? burned round and leave only my own in the center. You mean it? It went round. Yes. Fire went, went round. round. Yes, sir. And your own farm is in the center. Yes, sir. And no fire touch your farm. No fire. What a me. miracle working, Father! Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of choosing. Thank you, Father. Thank. I want us to clap unto God of choosing. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God of choosing. I want you to know that God of choosing knows everything about your life. Satan told God, Have you not made an edge round about Job and round about everything he, he has? That was the confession of Satan. He said, God made an edge round about Job and everything Job had. So God of choosing knows you and knows everything you have. And anything that will bring sorrow to you, he will not allow it. So I want you to know that you are in the right place. God of choosing will visit you today. He will bless you. He will heal you. He will command his deliverance upon your life. He will give you solution to all your problems in Jesus' name. Clap unto him. Appreciate him. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of choosing. The last testifier for today chosen praise the lord hallelujah my name is sam eche by god's grace i joined the church from the inception i'm here to thank this great god of the chosen for keeping me alive today in the world of the living thank you father if not the covenant our daddy had with almighty God confidence of life maybe by this Monday last Monday would have had that one have been a mortuary mm. on Sunday night around uh, 2 a.m. while I was sleeping I tried to turn to the right side only to discover excruciating pain in my stomach Mm. as if uh, that bundle of needle of pain in my stomach to breathe was even a problem so I was praying the spirit I was praying declaring who I, who I am and all that and all that and our covenant of pain, long life and all that then at a point I had a ministration that I should go and take a warm water then I, I waked up went to the kitchen boiled warm water then took another cold water to dilute it a bit. That was all I knew. The next thing I had was I felt as I'm starting now, fell backward on the ground immediately. Hmm. So I saw myself, I was a little conscious in the spirit. Then I started declaring there. Luckily, my daughter heard the noise and came out and saw, <laughs> saw her father on the, on the floor. Hmm. And then she shouted and called the brother and my wife and all that. They came and assisted me and sat down. And the pain was still there so much. Then uh, within five minutes, I had this, that voice that said, go and take that water. Then I managed to take the water again. 
within the next five minutes, uh, I feel like to go to the toilet. Brethren, uh, terrible things came out of my system that morning. Hmm. A lot of things I cannot explain. You know, for the best two, three minutes, I was there at the toilets, you know, releasing so many things out of my system, so black things and with different whatever. I can't explain them. And after that, I regained myself. It thank was you, Father. Thank you, God of choosing. Thank you, Lord. While I was praying and thanking God, I remember that on Saturday, somebody was sick. And I had the, my son told me about the person on Monday. Then I prayed for the person. Then that Saturday, I was asked to go and pray the play hand on the person. Otherwise, he would die the next four days. Then I went that Saturday and laid on hand on. And exactly what I felt, what, what that person was feeling. And I prayed for three days, he had not stepped down from the bed. After the prayer, he regained himself and started walking and all that. So it's exactly the same thing. That means they turned the thing against me. Mm. So that spirit of death that would have killed the person, they turned it against me. But because they came late, because they know, they don't know that I'm a chosen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So I thank Almighty God for the, these great protections and deliverance. May his name be highly be exalted in Jesus' name. Amen. I thank God Almighty who have called our daddy in the Lord. Consider him worthy to pilot this great revival train. It is not easy. He's not by whatever way he meditated. The God decided to give it to him. And that God who are giving him this grace will not depart from him. Amen. He will never allow him to make that mistake that uh, Moses made that made him also this promised land. Our daddy will see the promised land. Amen. You will make heaven at the end of your life in Jesus' name. Amen. God will continue to preserve his going out and coming in through across the sea, river and oceans and deserts in Jesus' name. Amen. God will bless him, multiply his grace and honor upon his life and the entire family. And God Almighty will bless the chosen ones. And this is a covenant that they have with God will always speak for us, always defend us at all times in Jesus' name. I pray that God will give us the grace to make heaven at the end of our life. In Jesus' perfect name we pray. Amen. Clap.